Uh, new releases. There's some yes. big ones. The, the holiday season is upon us. Mm-hmm. Mm. Uh, I guess Titanfall came out last Friday, but it's on this list. So I'm going to talk about Titanfall 2, because mm-hmm. that is a game I have finished. Mm. Mm. And how was it? Titanfall 2 is great. Yeah. Um, yeah. The, it, there is some really unexpected stuff in that campaign. Uh, and it's a maybe like a six hour campaign. Um, maybe, I don't know. You can probably finish it somewhere between five and seven hours, I would guess. That would be about six hours. <laughs> yeah. Um, it's so, of course, it has all the great like movement where you're running on the walls and doing all that stuff, and you jump into your mech and do all that stuff. Um, but the way that that works in single player, it's, like they have some portal type stuff in there. Um, there's uh, there's one level I won't I won't spoil, but it, there's a mechanic in there that's that's very. Uh, it's been done a little bit before, but the way they do it is is really interesting with the combat because the combat itself already feels feels really fast and and fun to play. Um, the I think the giant robots allow them to actually have boss battles in a first person game, which is sometimes a difficult thing to achieve. And the way that most levels end in this game are you get into your, your giant robot and you're fighting like either a wave of other giant robots that have a boss or some boss that has some, they, all the different bosses have different characteristics. Like one can fly and one of them has, like electrical power close with yeah all that stuff lightning yep fire um, ice yep <laughs> earth same same type of thing heart um disco there's but like the traversal stuff is just really fun like th- there's one level i don't know maybe a third into the game where you're in this factory that is producing uh, buildings environment type of thing and so you you start and it's basically there's like a big conveyor type factory going on, but you are jumping back and forth from the these big platforms that are getting turned into these environments, and they're getting twisted around. So you're having to jump off of them and shoot something to activate something, shoot guys, and then jump back onto them once they've rotated. It's there's a lot going on. It's, it's, so do you think that that, uh, I mean, I know we even talked about this when it came out, but was not having a single player in Titan, the first Titanfall, just a tremendous missed opportunity? I think it was, but I, I understand. I mean, they they were under the gun to get a game out because their whole separation with Activision and creating their own IP money. and everything. Need money right. badly. They needed, they needed money. So... This one, I I haven't even touched the multiplayer on it yet, but I hope it doesn't like just get eaten alive sales wise with being so class- close to Battlefield and Call of Duty. Those are the rumors. I, I it doesn't su- surprise me if that happens. It, yeah, it seems it's... like if they'd have put this game out like in that March February time frame, that it would Instead, probably. Instead, it just... feels like they sent it out to die. Which is weird for a game that's getting such strong reviews. It's it's really good. I mean, it definitely has some of the same like Call of Duty campaign type of things where it's very much like, okay, this is the level where I'm on a snowmobile or where I have this particular item. Yeah, um, that, that, that that works though. That yeah. constant does it that Call of Duty constant forward momentum feel. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. I'm a big fan of that. Yeah. And you'll get some you'll get some items in this game that you are like, really like, I really wish I, I didn't get that taken away from me after one level. Like there's plenty of like opportunity for them to, to expand on this either in the next game or add DLC for some of the mechanics they introduce and then uh, aren't there the next level. Um, But yeah, it's the only thing that's, <sighs> The the storyline, I don't. It's very much a. 
there's an empire basically that you're fighting against. It's a continuation of that campaign that was in the first game. If you remember that at all, remember how they had the multiplayer yeah. campaign, oh, yeah. quote unquote campaign. Yeah. So it's that same type of storyline, but I don't know. It, there, it's good enough to like go, okay, yeah, we're going to stop the bad guys from blowing up a planet. As Basically the bad guys have created a Death Star. It. Yeah. I want to play it. I'll get I, it at I some point. Should. I, it has it has some stuff in there from games that you enjoyed, so cool. Yep, I highly recommend Titanfall too. Yeah, it's getting good uh, feedback. Somebody uh, had a good point uh, in the uh, CAG bag at Duran six oh three uh, asks: Would more people be buying Titanfall two if the first game had ca- a campaign mode? Do you think it's getting hurt because the first one didn't? People just uh, forget about the fact that uh, people didn't buy, you know, the first one could have been more successful if it had a campaign. But do you think people are just are ignoring this one because they assume it doesn't have a campaign or maybe they feel like. They I, just- I can see that. I think the people that were uninformed the first time are probably still just as uninformed. So when they see it on the shelf, they just pass it by. I, I can see that. Sure. Especially since that's crazy. The, the other sequel games are sort of a known quantity. And they're two of the biggest franchises in gaming. Yeah. I, I, I you, you the, stuck this, the, yeah. this game right in between the battlefield and call of duty. Right. Two games that are, you know, <laughs> you're couldn't be more direct competitors. Basically. I mean, they're basically the same games, <laughs> but I don't know. I guess they, I don't know. Couldn't they have waited longer? Everybody just went, took a long vacation and not get paid for like <laughs> three months, six months. I don't know. I'm gonna. I'll. I, uh, I wish they put out something. I if they would have put this on EA Access, I think it might have helped it as well, just to give people a reminder of why this game I is so have fun. Definitely have checked out the single player already if it was on EA Access. There's no doubt in my mind. You, it's not too late for them to do that, and you might see something like that, and they just put like an hour limit on the, on the. On I the wouldn't campaign. be surprised if it's if it's there by December, depending upon how sales go. Oh, before they should do it before, so people know how to we'll ask for out. it for Christmas. Yeah, Call of Duty comes out when this show is when people are listening to this. Call of Duty will be on, in stores. It comes out on Friday. The yeah. new, yeah. Why is every, everything come out on Friday now? Is I that- don't, you know, I don't hate it. I like the idea of getting a game on a Friday because you have the weekend. Sure, but there, so, they, they must have done the the uh, crunch the numbers on that. I think we talked about this like years ago. That game should be coming out on Fridays, not Tuesdays. It, maybe they just listened to that episode from eight years ago. <laughs> I don't know. Also, the robot in this game, your robot kind of sounds like Optimus Prime. <laughs> That's not, good. That's a plus. not exactly, but but it's a, it's enough that you're like, yep. I, I enjoy this. Talk Does to he have more. a heart of gold? Uh, yeah. Good. It, you get to have uh, like dialogue choice options with him too. I heard the robot has personality, but the the character that you play does not. I guess uh, not nearly as much personality as the robot. I'll I'll say that. Like I guess depending on what dialogue choices you make, and it's it's just like. You have two dialogue choices to respond to the robot with at certain times. So you could add a little bit of personality to your character with those, but. Right. All right. I oh. Sounds like you really enjoyed it. Titanfall yeah, 2. Yeah, great. 